Adena is a national data center uh, based at the University of Edinburgh, uh, designated by GISC, which is uh, the shared services group for universities and colleges in the UK. And our particular role is to develop and deliver online services for use by students and staff, uh, whether they are researchers um, or teachers in the universities and colleges. Some things have been in the foreground, some things in the background, because um, as I indicated, we're there to develop services, but also infrastructure, middleware as we call it, for use by the universities and colleges, and indeed by other services that provide things for staff and students. So particular things I think have been the recognition of the importance of uh, the open agenda, uh, open access has become very much central. So what does that mean? That means the way in which researchers can share their material easily so that it can be easily read by researchers and students across the world. We played a big part in that as planning the OR 2012 conference with 450 people attending from well over 40 countries. Other areas? Well, other areas include what's going on with research data. So research data, again, very much of the fore. Uh, working with the data library, which is very much part of ADENA, focusing on the University of Edinburgh, but delivering nationally um, what's something called MANTRA, which is uh, taught materials geared at postgraduates, but usable by academic support staff and researchers on how to manage research data, ensuring ease and uh, continuity of access to journal content through the Keeper's Registry. And that's now being pushed very much as an international uh, facility because the researchers in the UK both require and also produce material of international quality. With something which we're all very familiar with, namely the importance of location-based services, uh, the map on the internet and the mobile internet. In this we've been ahead of the game I guess since well before 2000 and the result of that we're delivering up uh, ordnance survey mapping geological mapping and moving out to soil as well as we have other sorts of uh, important scientific information available to students and staff. 80% of our users there are not geographers per se, they're studying uh, field biology or historians or economists or other engineers and now they can have that delivered to them on their mobile as well as onto their desktop for high grade work. Um, it's an area we've been at the front for a very long time and has taken us into lots of European Union project work. I think what we are doing as part of the JISC family of organisations that provide uh, productivity service to universities and colleges is uh, planning for a more coherent presentation of those services to colleges and universities as they themselves become the governors and JISC no longer is just a government funded organisation.